right, we're back with another video. Uh, in this video, we're going to be talking about the book. We mentioned the last couple of, uh, last couple, I think it was the last video that we mentioned the book, that we wrote a book about uh, name being Word Has It You're Moving, about uh, topics regarding moving, from the moment you decide to sell your home to the moment you unpack on the other side. Um, a lot of our customers show up here at our store and they have no idea as to what to do. From the mom, from the question, should, should I use an agent to the to what should I use in terms of packaging materials? Uh, should I have a lawyer? Should I use movers? What kind of mover is good? What kind of mover is bad? You know anyone who can help me? Uh, all kinds of things they they ask about that we figure. What? Why don't we write a book? With um, although we're not writers, uh, but uh, writing about uh, a range of topics from the moment you set your home to the moment you want back on the other side. It's a really pretty good book, straight, easy read, uh, uh, short, it's around about 165 pages, 167 pages, 170, sorry, all together. Uh, and uh, it's entertaining too. It's fun and uh, very informative. As I said, we're not writers, we're pastors of information. So today, along with the book, uh, there was one topic specifically we mentioned that I just mentioned that we did not we did not write on the book, and that topic is: Should you use a real estate agent if you decide to sell your home or find an apartment? That's an important topic. We didn't write it. Didn't write it. We didn't add it to the book. Perhaps in the next revision we'll add it. Uh, revision number two. But I figured, you know, at the same time, I would like to, I promised you, and I wanted to introduce you to the other side of the equation. Our, our business is R&D Moving and Storage Supplies. You met the R, you haven't met the D. The D is the morning dawn. <laughs> her name is Dawn. And I would like you to introduce, you to, to, uh, introduce her to you or, and you to her uh, so that we can uh, discuss that topic together. Okay, so I'd like to welcome Dawn into the screen, into the video. So this is Dawn. Hello, everyone. As you know, I'm Raul. We're R&D. R&D. We're the smile of the business. <laughs> And uh, as I said, we mentioned that we wrote this together. So we're going to discuss the uh, topic of uh, should you use an agent or not if you decide to sell your home or if you need somebody to help find you an apartment, okay? An apartment, what's the benefits, what's the, what's the cons of using it? An apartment's pretty straightforward. An agent has access to a lot of uh, apartments. So, and uh, they can negotiate prices for you with an apartment. That's pretty straightforward. It's a great, and it costs you nothing. Now, selling your home. It's a different story, right, Dawn? Exactly. So I'll get to do the disadvantages, and you can do the advantages. All right. That's so, a good move. bearer of bad news. So I guess the biggest one is the commission. 5% on a million dollars is a big chunk of money that goes bye bye right? Correct. Yeah, if it's like $100,000, $150,000, not bad. Or if you're buying your home more through an agent, no, the cash is zero. That's very good. But if you're selling your home, and at the end, you watch, you hand out that commission plus tax on top. That's a lot of money, yes, right? Exactly. So uh, <laughs> that's not a very, uh, very, very accommodating idea, okay? Exactly. And then the Another next one? one would be having to drop your own contract if you do sell it on your own. Yeah. Uh, very tedious if you're not very. Um, which, 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 which you can't. As you can't uh, drop. Once you're locked into a contract with an agent, you're locked to the agent. If you sell it on your own, you're in trouble. You have to, you're going to meet the judge together in court somewhere. Exactly. Because you're going to have to pay the agent one over the other. So once you're in the contract, you're locked in. Which was the other one. They go hand in hand. Either you're locked into a contract, and then writing up your own contract is tedious. Which is the other one? If you yeah. sell, a, if you if, if you use an if you don't, if you don't use an agent, you have to draw your own contract, right? Exactly. Um, Not so, to be the top three, I think of. The yeah. Disadvantages. Disadvantage. A lot more advantages. Yeah, advantage. Yeah, we, uh, advantage. We have, uh, we're not going to stretch this video too long, by the way. We're going to try to shorten and make it as quick as possible. But advantages is for the first uh, again. We don't like to pay the money, but the agent has access to a lot, a lot of people. The MLS system that they use, they have, they have access to millions of people out there, and uh, they, uh, your your list of buyers just increases substantially, right? Exactly. Another, another advantage, of course, of what you just mentioned, is using the contract. Uh, they draw all the contracts for you. They help you find the lawyers. 
they help you find insurance companies. They have a list of tools in their belt, which means includes uh, mortgage brokers. Like it's very uh, wide based uh, the information they have. Uh, they, they help they have for you. Uh, but uh, uh, mainly it's the amount of people they can expose your home to, right? Exactly. Also, agents can uh, can find the best possible way to sell your home to get the most out of your home, right? And also, but also towards the, the seller as well, because it helps the seller as well to make a, a more informed decision. But sellers can uh, help you with the clutter. They can help you uh, with staging, which both of those items are, are, are huge when it comes to getting more money out of your home to draw the most potential out of, of, the, out of the sale. Uh, agents, uh, they, they, as you said, they, they, they draw the, all the contracts for you. And of course, they, they're, all, they're relentless. They're always looking for people for you. They, if they don't find a way, they go to another way and they go to another and another and another until they find you a, a, a buyer, right? Um, also, uh, which another, which we, I mentioned to, I meant to say as well, it depends also the conditions of the market. For example, if the market is hot, such as just happened uh, very recently, right? We're on October 5th. 2022 for the last few years has been crazy especially the last year or so last year and a half has been amazing you so much have to put a flag outside your home and selling my home people come to you like beast of honey they run they run to you so you can actually get away without using an agent because you had so much more uh, exposure to so many people out there and they're so anxious to get a home they'll give you any money you want for it any money meaning they pay a much higher price, okay? Oh, we've had customers come in and say they got over 100000 more on their asking price just because. Yeah, pretty much. No, most people that came to see us yeah. during these last few years has been like more than what I was asking. So that would, have, that, would have, that would have been, a, 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 in that case, it's, again, you, you can, you can uh, overcome all those cons by all the money you get so easy with a, by getting customers a lot easier because everybody wants to buy a home. When the market is slow, really slow then you're gonna really need an agent because an agent again can be exposure to a lot of people um, and a lot of markets that they, they can get so much more for you than if you did it on your own yeah and you've got professional photographers take pictures of your home uh, yeah they use sellable yeah they, they use professional professional photographers the pictures are much nicer um, but if in times when the market is slow, you need as much exposure as you can get. You need all the tools you can get. And agents, yeah, they have pretty much all the tools to get your home sold. Exactly. As quickly and as high as possible. And that's right? what we like. Exactly. And we, of course, are there because we work with a lot of agents that help uh, that, that require our information, our products to help their customer make the, the get the best sale for their home right the, the best buck so i think that's it right i think that's it we've covered it all i don't think we missed much but if you if you missed something you want to know about it post a question below uh let us know about it and we'll we can answer for you um and uh, as always we want to say subscribe yeah subscribe to the channel because we're always posting videos and we are going to post a lot of videos now on the topics of the book that way if you uh, if you uh, if you don't want to get it, just one, basically want some uh, some information on the book, or get a better idea of how good the book is to what we tell you, we'll do some some videos, and that way you can, you can then say you know what yeah that sounds very interesting, and go ahead and order it. They'll come to our store to spend a certain amount of money, and uh, you can get up to uh, I think one hundred fifty dollars that they spend get a free book. Yeah, absolutely, one hundred fifty dollars. You get a book. free book, or spend seventy five and you pay five dollars. You pay five dollars for the book. Not bad. We get it from Amazon, nine ninety nine. Nine ninety five. Nine ninety five, which also is pretty good. So, anyways, we're gonna talk a lot of, uh, talk a lot about a lot of the topics here, and Don is gonna be more uh, uh, the face behind in front of the camera, and I'll be more the face behind the camera, so we can both uh, you get to uh, watch your smile, a <laughs> beautiful smile every day. I mean, through all the videos, I mean every day. <laughs> you the get videos. to see my smile every day. <laughs> And uh, yeah, we'll uh, we'll be bringing up a lot more topics about the book. Okay, as mentioned, post the questions below, any comments you may have, any suggestions you may have, and we'll uh, we'll answer to you, and we appreciate it. Okay, again, subscribe to our channel so you'll be a part of the family, and um, post a, hit a like. Okay, until next time. Till next time, thank you. It was nice to meet you again. Bye.